Hi, I'm Rose harris Bertil from MoneySavingExpert.com and today I'm going to show you how to fit two weeks worth of stuff into your hand luggage only. So first of all, it's a good idea to think about exactly what you're packing. Try and think essentials only. So for example, I've got a towel here. I'm not bringing one of these. Now this is because nowadays even budget hotels will be providing you with a towel, so I don't need that. Um, also, think about wearing any heavier items, so wear your heavier jackets maybe. I've got a jacket here that I can wear instead of packing it. And once you've got your jacket on, also don't forget you can stuff the pockets as well with any extra bits and pieces. And the same goes for shoes as well. If you've got any hiking boots or trainers, you can actually just wear these on the plane so you don't have to pack them. Okay, so let's move on to how you pack now. So there's three main techniques here. The first one is called layering. Now this is really useful if you've got items like dresses as I've got here or shirts or maybe a suit uh, that you don't want to fold or roll up, you can actually just pop them in using the flat layer of the bag um, and then you pack everything else on top and you just fold the top round it as well. Now the second method is actually folding. Now this is one you probably already use at home. It's literally where you just fold the item up. So here I've got some trousers, just folding them up and you can just pop them straight in the bag here. Now, the third method here would be then rolling. Now, what I'm doing is I actually like to roll it when it's already folded, it saves time. And if I show you, just rolling this up as tightly as possible here, then it takes up a lot less space. But also, when you're at the other end, it's ready to go straight into your, oh, straight into your drawers at the other side. Okay, so if you find anything's creased at the other end, uh, have a hot shower when you get to your hotel and you can actually hang your items in the shower room and the steam should help the creases to come out. Now, when you're packing, pack from the heaviest items at the bottom of your suitcase to the lightest at the top and this will help you with balance when you're packing. So for shoes, pack them toe to heel if you can and that will help to save some space. Now here, I've actually got my socks rolled up into these great little sock balls and a really easy way that you can do this at home. If you get your socks and you just lay them end to end like that and you roll them up really tightly from the toe all the way up to the top. And then if you hold the bottom and you just take the top part, fold it over the top, you've got a sock ball. Now I've also got a bag for personal items, anything extra that you might have got that I haven't got here. So um, I've also got a little shopping bag here, a little cloth bag that you can use for the beach if you want to. I've got some um, plugs here so that I can charge my e-reader and my phone. And I've also got a little sarong here. Now those are really useful as well because you can wear it at the beach, you can put it around your neck as a scarf on the plane if you're um, a bit chilly, and you can also use these to cover your neck and your shoulders if you're visiting religious sites on holiday. And now at the end of the packing, I can just take the hanger off my items that I've layered in and just pull that over as well. And that's the main bag packed. Now, uh, I've got my passport, I've got my boarding card here as well, and put these items in the outside so that you can get to them really quickly when you get to the airport. I've also got toiletries, and a few extra bits and pieces for the plane. And my all important e-reader. That's it, how to pack two weeks, one lot of hand luggage. Have a lovely holiday.